Shalom, brothers and sisters. So the Irish farmers are outraged over the government's plan to cull, kill, murder 200,000 cows to meet climate goals. And then they'll celebrate by eating fake meat afterwards, or plants, or plastic. Irish farmers are pushing back against the proposal by the government to cull hundreds of thousands of cows in the hopes of meeting their commitment to becoming climate neutral. A report by the Irish Department of Agriculture outlined, outlined how 200,000 cows would be killed over the next three years to meet the carbon targets. The plan would reportedly come at a cost of 600 million euros to taxpayers, with the document indicating that 5,000 euros per cow would be offered as compensation. The president of the Irish Farmers Association, Tim Cullinan, said that the plan would only serve to increase farmers' mistrust in the government and will not have the intended environmental aims. He said reducing dairy or beef production in Ireland will also lead to carbon leakage with production moving to other countries with a higher carbon footprint and this is likely to increase global warming rather than reducing it. It's hilarious when they use their own arguments against themselves. Microsoft founder Bill Gates has said that he believes all wealthy nations should switch to 100% synthetic beef and he has provided financial backing for meat alternative brands like impossible foods impossible to eat and beyond meat because it'll probably kill you synthetic meats are often made using genetic modification what could go wrong and their long-term effects on human life are not known lab grown meats also fall short when it comes to nutrition with many options lacking protein and other important nutrients. And now this is going to sound really conspiracy nut to you, but there's a lot of evidence for it out there already. Their next step, probably after we're gone, will be to start eating each other, because then they're really helping the carbon footprint. They resort back to cannibalism, because, I mean, what else could be more shocking right now? And, you know, no need for animals. Welcome to Crazy Evil Dark World. Very, very short episode of seven years and then it'll wrap for the whole of humanity once and for all. And then God himself will come and show us how it's actually supposed to have been done. I, for one, cannot wait. Keep looking up. Shalom.